This is a top-down view of an almost completed spaceship, but you can see I have one engine. And what I would like is another engine identical to this one that I can slap on the other side. And fortunately, I created it as a component. If you're not sure how to make components, you can watch the component video uh, in one of the earlier modules. So what I need to do is copy this, and it's a combination of the Move tool and a keyboard key. So if you hold the Control button and the Move tool at the same time, it creates a copy. But this copy is not a mirror image. It's identical. And if you look on the inside, you can see some of the details on the inside of the engine or the right side of the engine are different than the details on the left. So what I need to do is right click and rotate it. Uh, and I'm going to rotate on the red axis so it makes a mirror image. And now when we look at it, we can see um, all of the details on the inside are on the inside and the outside details are on the outside. So that is the first step to copying that component. Now that I have my engines copied, I need to line them up on the ends of the wings. And what I would really like to do is uh, have this thing be perfectly symmetrical. So I'm going to um, pick a point on the first engine and use my move tool. You notice I'm zooming in so I can have really precise aim. I'm going to pick that point and I'm going to line it up with a point on the wing. So I'm just sliding my move tool in place and you can see they mate right there. They want to link up at that point. But when I look at it, I get this really funny overlap of pieces. So what I'm going to do is this. I'm going to change my view. I'm going to orbit around to a more sideways view. And I'm just going to slide that piece to the front just a little bit. And in doing that, it gets rid of that overlapped edge. Um, and I need to repeat that process on the other side. So again, using my orbit tool and my zoom tools, all of my viewing tools that you should be familiar with at this point, uh, to get the best angle. And you notice when I start to move this one, what happens is I can't see the wing. Uh, my engine is actually blocking it. So I need to change my perspective, change what I'm looking at. And it always helps to zoom because it gives you a better idea of where your anchor points are going to be. Uh, again, orbiting around, uh, I get it linked in place. I notice it's not quite lining up the way I want. So I'm going to move this in the same amount. And I actually used my VCB this time to move it the exact same increment, uh, three inches backwards. And now I have a completed symmetrical spaceship. So using the component tools and uh, some of the copy tools and some moving tricks, you can create a really interesting spaceship.